This is a neat aspect of amateur radio, and that is the ability to send email by radio. Now, you can find all about this online. We're not going to go into the nuts and bolts of the software, but you can go to winlink.org. That's W-I-N-L-I-N-K dot O-R-G. In this case, we're using an RMS Express, which is the client. What you see here is a handheld UHF VHF radio. So we're using, in this case, two meters. This is called a TNC or terminal node controller. This particular one is made for amateur radio and it's made by a company called Cantronics and it's a KP3+. Um, we're running this whole system, again, just keeping the theme of preparedness communications. This whole system right now is running on battery power and um, I have a cell phone here and we're just gonna do a demonstration of sending a message via RMS Express, and hopefully we'll see it appear on this cell phone. So I'm gonna, I'm using a Mac, um, but I'm running Windows on a uh, emulator called Parallels, and I have the RMS Express client up and running. I have a test message that I made, and I saved it to the outbox, and now I'm just gonna activate a session and see if we can send that. Okay, well I'm just checking the inbound messages and I had sent this test message to my buddy here and I just got a message back from him via his iPhone. Of course this will work on any um, any phone system, but um, regarding your WinLink message number two, woohoo, sent from my iPhone, and that was just um, earlier this morning, so we know that that test message earlier uh, was successful. Okay, so we're gonna type a test message. And I'm gonna say, thank you for the help. I'm gonna say 73, and my buddy knows that that means best regards, and David. I'm going to save that or post it to the outbox. We're going to open another session. And we'll start that session. Logging on. Message sent. Logged off. So quite that quickly. And there you go, we just sent a message using RMS Express email via amateur radio to this iPhone. And I just got two more messages inbound when it logged off. So very useful system. Um, and in this case, I'm a technician class license amateur radio operator, so I'm using um, VHF, UHF, but this system has even more capability when you link it up with HF capability and um, excellent way to stay in touch with people and um, send messages not only between amateur radio operators but you can also send it to anybody's email they don't have to be an amateur radio operator and you can also send it to someone's iPhone or any phone that can receive text messages and in this case I know the person that owns this phone is not an amateur radio operator yet but uh, will be soon, but uh, just demonstrates the um, unique capability that this has with amateur radio, the ability to send email by radio. So one great application for this is, for example, during a disaster, if you wanted to get welfare messages out from a local area that's affected by a disaster and there is no cell phone capability, with this system, you can get messages out and let family and friends know that are outside the disaster, say in a neighboring state or somewhere else in the country, that you're safe and okay, what your plan is. And a nice thing is you can share that with uh, neighbors and friends and help get messages out to their loved ones to let them know that they're safe and that they're gonna be okay. So that is another useful application for um, RMS Express using WinLink, sending email by amateur radio. <laughs>